going. No, oh. Mavic. Solo. Mavic. Solo. Mavic. Which one do you want better? Solo. <laughs> so you want the solo, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Hello everyone, as you guys know I have two drones, the 3DR Solo Drone and the DJI Mavic Pro and many ask why. So I decided to do a side-by-side -side comparison of 3D Solo Drone and DJI Mavic Pro. Before we begin, this is not a complete comparison but enough to cover the basic and what's important for me and for my personal use. What are we doing Kaden? We are having a review. We are having a review about? Which one is better? 3D or solo? And I have the DJI Mavic Pro. Round one, fight! So which one do you think is better for the size? What? Why? Because it'll be more stable. And it's easier to see up the sky, yeah. right? Okay. And how about when you travel? How about when you travel? Yeah, it's pretty nice. The 3DR Solo Drone weighs about 3.31 pounds, that's not including the camera and as you can see in this video, the, with everything, with accessory and everything, it gets a little bit heavy. DJI Mavic Pro weighs about 1.64 pounds and as you can see the bag with three batteries and the charger, it's still small and it's very easy to carry around. Still on round one, we're gonna compare about the remote control. Same goes with the remote control, the 3D Solo Drone gets a bit heavy while you're flying it. However, for the DJI Mavic Pro, their controller is really small and portable. You can gain muscles from doing this. <laughs> Going like this while you're flying. You just be like, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Gaining some muscles while flying my drone. Two, fight! Three. The battery life, right? Mm -hmm. Got this battery for me. How much? This Wait. one can run 20 minutes. And this yours run. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> How much does mine run? 3DR Solid Drone on their website it says 25 minutes without the gimbal and the camera and 20 minutes with, but my actual flight time was 15 minutes with the gimbal and the camera. For DJI, it was estimated 27 minutes with the gimbal and the camera. I get about 20 minutes flight time. <laughs> so, battery life? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> three, round three! three. Fight. Fight. Very okay, show me how. You just press this twice. twice. Hold it, hold it until it feel a bump, and then hold it again until it feel. Okay, and how do you land? Okay. And for me, to fly it, you have to press this two joystick down at the same time that will start the propeller and then once it's already start you just press it up mm -hmm. so it'll go up a little bit and no cover. For return home you can either press this one right here or you can press the uh -oh. home button right yeah. here. Both drones have their preset modes. The 3DR Solid Drone have a smart flying which includes the pre-map flight pads, orbits, lock on follow and selfie and for the DJI Mavic Pro, they have the intelligent mode which includes the follow me, course lock, waste points, and home lock. Round 4! Fight! Fight! 3DR Solid Drone starts about 499 They do go on sale and for me with everything else, the accessory, it cost me about $600 for the DJI Mavic Pro. The combo with all the accessories that are showing in the video cost me about $1,300. For the summary, both companies did a really good job for their drones. It just depends on what you need and what you're going to use it for and of course what's your price range. 3DR Solo Drone is straightforward and very easy to use, highly recommended for a beginner. The DJI Mavic Pro is so small and it's so easy to carry everywhere you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching.
What you doing? <laughs> what is it called? <laughs> the Mavic? The Mavic. This is home.